welcome back to Southern Snack. We're live. It's too short to be serious. All right, folks, we're back at Baskin Robbins for one last summer treat from them. I expect they'll start to kind of phase into fall once August is done. Thankfully, they didn't go ahead and jump into fall in August, you know. Some places are doing that. Anyways, uh, they've got a new strawberry, uh, I guess, iced strawberry toaster treat. Uh, frosted strawberry toaster treat. Got the name right. Uh, it's hard to remember. It's just a complicated name. And you know, in marketing, they say uh, complicated names can be a bit too much. You got to go for short, catchy, memorable, and I don't know. So we'll have to see, but there's a lot going on with this. It's supposed to be uh, toaster treat flavored. So like a pastry flavored um, ice cream, strawberry jam swirl, uh, pastry pieces, and then you know the icing that comes on top of the strawberry pop tart. It's got rainbow icing flakes. So a lot going on. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know if I'm very excited, but you know, I review everything. So uh, yeah, we're trying it. So if you'll hit that subscribe button, like and comment on this video, we'll be grooving and moving, right? Um, but yeah, if you guys have any recommendation, just give them here. Here we go. Hmm. That's really interesting. That is a burst of all kinds of sweetness and artificial flavor. And quite honestly, I ain't complaining because that's what you should expect, right? It's supposed to taste like a strawberry pop tart without saying it's actually a strawberry pop tart. You know, Crumble just did a strawberry pop tart cookie. Man, this is, this makes, that puts that to shame. And usually Baskin Robbins can't put Crumble to shame. Crumble is amazing. But this, this right here, between the crunchiness of it, to the strawberry flavor, to that buttery pastry undertone. My goodness. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I wasn't sure what to expect here. But I certainly can be very appreciative of this flavor. It's different. You're not going to see this every day unless Kellogg's decides to team up with an ice cream brand and do a new ice cream line. You're not going to see this. It's sweet, artificial, got that tartness that you'd get. And it hits the flavor right on the head. Of course, I've never been the biggest part Pop Tart fan. I would definitely prefer a fresh you know strawberry treat or fresh pastry but for what we have this is actually quite good i'm gonna go ahead and say it's an eight just because i don't love it but i think it has a nice vibe to it i know other people will say it's higher but man worth a try anyways i will see y'all around